Shalom, brothers and sisters. This is Pastor Omar Tebow making another vacation stop. We over here in Alexandria, Virginia, and we made a stop at a place called the Freedom House. Now, originally it was not the Freedom House. It was everything but what freedom has to do with freedom. Uh, this was actually the headquarters of Franklin and Armfield. Isaac Franklin and John Armfield uh, bought and sold slaves. And in the 1800s, specifically around 1830, they would buy slaves and ship them down to places like Mississippi, Alabama, and Louisiana. It's been known from their own books that they probably sold probably about a thousand slaves per year. And so a lot of our people down in Louisiana most probably passed through this headquarter location uh, making our way back to the south. Uh, uh, Franklin and, and Armfield would normally purchase a slave from about $500 to $1,000. Uh, a lot of us in America think that every white person could have owned a slave. Uh, but $500 to $1,000 back then would be equivalent uh, to $32,000 today. Let me tell you something. The average white person did not own slaves. The plantation owners were not average white folk, amen? Uh, usually, a lot of times, they were Ashkenazis. They were the serpent people. The same people that's running things right now uh, were running things back then. When you do your history, uh, a lot of people who were fighting in the Civil War, a lot of the Confederates were not slave owners. It was only the elite. It was only the rich. It was only the wealthy. And so, think about it. Who could buy a slave today for $32,000? I would dare say that the majority population of European Americans could not do it, but that 1% could. The Ashkenazis could. And so we got to watch ourselves, uh, uh, white folk and black folk, mad at each other when we got an enemy in the middle of us agitating both sides. This is Pastor Omar Tebow from the Freedom House in Alexandria, Virginia. Brothers and sisters, make your way down to the freedom house come learn your history come learn about what's really going on in america and what really happened during the slave trade love y'all talk to y'all at the next stop shalom